So guys, today I'm going to show you how to go from this short taper cut with transitioning shape sides to this sleek, fabulous, gorgeous, half up, half down hairstyle using removable quick weave. Yes, I said removable. You can actually take this style off and put it back on anytime you want to. How freaking awesome is that? So if you want to see how I achieve this look, keep watching. Don't go anywhere. For supplies, you're gonna need a water bottle, lots of styling gel for those growing out shave sides, and got to be glued to freeze those sides into place, and you're gonna need bobby pins. For your quick weave, you're gonna need a hot glue gun. I got mine off Amazon. You're gonna need some glue sticks. I like to use the black ones, they're seamless. A mannequin head, and your favorite wig cap. I'm using a spandex wig cap. So, let's get started. So I'm starting with freshly co-washed and conditioned hair. First, I'm going to spray my hair down and gently detangle. And then I'm going to separate the front from the back for the half up, half down look. So we're going to spray it down a little bit more. Add some Eco Styling Gel to get those sides nice and smooth and flat. So once I get it gelled down uh, sufficiently, I'm just gonna brush it into place and then put it in a ponytail. And right now we're just prepping the front so we can braid down the back. And this is how much hair I have sectioned off for the half up section. Now, in the back you're gonna need anchor braids to hold your quick weave. So I'm just gonna braid two horizontal cornrows down the middle of my head at the top of the back section. And my shave sides are growing out so nicely. You can see I'm able to actually braid it all the way down. Uh, if you remember my crochet braid tutorials, that part was shaved. Um, so I'm so excited about having a full head of hair again. And to seal the ends, I just add a little bit of styling gel and twirl it around my finger. And so I'm gonna separate the back and I'm gonna add two cornrows going straight back. Now you could put this part in a ponytail and tuck it away, but I like to braid my hair underneath my weaves. Now to create the half up section, I am going to add more gel so it lays nice and smooth in my ponytail. This is where your gel comes into place. And once you get it sufficiently gelled down, then I just brush and brush like crazy so the hair is really smooth, there aren't any lumps or any waves in it, and my, again, the sides can lay super flat. And now I'm just adding a very thin layer of got to be glue to freeze the sides into place. And while we wait for that to dry, we're gonna start making our removable quick weave. So here I'm using a wig that I previously made that I cut into place so I can measure out where to cut my uh, wig cap. And guys, I just went back about five inches where your parting would normally stop and that's how I measured off where to start my quick removable quick weave. And I'm using translucent powder to mark off where my tracks should start. For the style, I chose the Organique Super Wave. You get three 18, 20, and 22 inch bundles and I got it in the color 1B and this curl pattern is so pretty. And this hair is super affordable, you guys. I think it was $26 for this pack. And now I'm just gonna quick weave the hair on and I am cutting my wefts because this is synthetic hair, why not? And I'm just going to continue to glue until I get all the hair installed. The glue sticks dry super fast, so you have to move quickly. What I recommend is laying down a little bit of glue at a time and then laying your track and continuing that process until you're all done. And you can see you're left with this little U-shaped area in the center, so I'm gonna lay tracks horizontally until that space is filled in. And we're all done installing the tracks. Now I'm just kind of going through the hair to remove any of the shedding hair from cutting the tracks. And the next step is to cut off your excess cap. Hey, 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 hey,
And we're gonna glue one track on the inside of the cap to hide any tracks that may be showing on the outside of the cap. And this is what your finished quick weave should look like. So I'm gonna show you my braiding pattern one more time so you can see exactly what it looks like. And the next step is to add our quick weave. Now I did sew in some combs so I could use the combs to attach it. You could sew this on, but I didn't feel like doing that. I'm not gonna wear the style for that long. And so I went for the combs, which really makes this a quick removable style. The last step is to create our ponytail. So I'm just gonna secure the weft in place with the bobby pin and I'm using the last bundle, the shortest bundle in the package uh, to do this. I did use the other two remaining bundles for the half down section and then just wrap and flip, wrap and flip. This part does take some getting used to but you will get the hang of it. It's super easy to do. I did not have to add bobby pins Throughout the process, I only use the bobby pin in the beginning and then the end to secure the tracks. Now I'm just gonna take a section of the hair uh, from the back and wrap it around the base of the ponytail um, to make it a little bit higher and give it a seamless high ponytail look. Secure that one into place and voila, this is the finished look. And it was so easy and quick to accomplish this style. And you guys know I love an on-the-go style. This one takes a little more work, but it's so cute and it's so worth it. This is super cute. It's perfect for an upcoming, and look at that dress. Ooh, that girl been working out. Yeah. <laughs> But you guys, this style is so cute. I think it's perfect for this holiday season. So get ready to slay all night, girlfriend, in your removable quick weave. So you guys, that will do it for this tutorial. Let me know what styles you're rocking this holiday season. Thank you for tuning in. I appreciate you so much. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave me some comments. Let me know what you think about this removable quick weave on transitioning shave sides. And until the next video, stay beautiful, stay blessed, and make sure you get fit and fab.